All right, here is a quick guide on how to do VLOOKUPs. VLOOKUPs are a super versatile, super easy tool to use, and they seem extremely complicated, but they're really not. So let's dive right into it. In my last video, which you may or may not have watched, I showed you how to sort emails by their uh, domain names. If you do not know how to do that and you want to know how to do that, check that out. It's super useful. Now let's say that someone sends you a list of these sorted emails with their domain names and you have a differently sorted list of corresponding first names and you would like to match these first names to the emails. Now you can see that our first name here is Barbara and our first name here is Twanda. So we want to find the Barbara email somewhere in this list and match it to Barbara's first name. Now you could try and play around with sorting it or go one by one and find each one, but instead of doing that, we can use a VLOOKUP. So what a VLOOKUP does is it takes a certain value in the list that we're forming called the lookup value, press a comma, and it's gonna look in a certain table array, which is this table in this case. It could be more than two rows. It has to be at least two rows, but it can be 200 rows. It could be any amount of rows. You're gonna be looking in some table array and let's lock that in. On a Mac, it's Command-T. Um, on a PC, I believe it's Control-F4 uh, to lock in the table array. And then the column index number is the column in the table that you're going to be drawing the data out of. So we're looking for Barbara in our table, but we're going to be drawing an email out of our table, so we'll be looking out of the second column. And lastly, the range lookup, we want an exact match because we're looking for the email. So we want the exact email, and if there is no email, it'll give us back an error. So as you can see, it found Barbara in this list, and it grabbed her email, and it brought it right up here for me. So I can double click this and apply it to everything. And instead of having to mess around doing this one by one, a VLOOKUP does it all for me instantaneously. Super easy and effortless.